Hey Downtimers, today we're going to look at the Gamer's Gift Guide for items that I've recently purchased for $30 or less. Now these are going to be items that you can get all times of the year obviously, but it's going to be really good if you're buying for a gamer, especially if your gamer likes to craft. All links, descriptions, and prices are going to be linked below in the description. So be sure to check that out if you're interested in purchasing any of these. These are all based on quality and bang for your buck. So, number five, Riz Dice Bag of Devouring. 140 polyhedral dice and 20 complete sets for $29.99 on Amazon. Really can't beat that. That's pretty good bang for your buck. And uh, can you ever really have enough dice? I don't think you can ever really have too much dice, right? There's never too many dice. I have, I have half of this bag or most of this bag all over the place. So um, this is only just a small portion of what comes in the bag. 140 total, $29.99, and a pretty nice bag too. Nice bag. Number four, if your gamer also enjoys painting, uh, you might want to check out Craft Mode. You can get these on Amazon for about 17 bucks or so. They're really pretty decent paint brushes. Pretty good for your bang for your buck there. So uh, yeah, and lots of them as you can see. So that's Craft Mode. And the reviews online on Amazon are actually pretty good for these. So I'm excited. I haven't even had a chance to start using these yet. Part of my early Christmas here. Number three. Again, if your gamer is really into crafting as well, you really can't go wrong with just about anything at greenstuffworld.com. These mega cobblestone rollers, really all of them, I like all the mega, the really big uh, rolling pins. Uh, you can make really large tiles with these. The rolling pin here is a little bit over a foot long. The textured portion is right at a foot. You know, you can make really large tiles with these. They actually work pretty well. The depth of the the texture, the depth of the cut from the pen isn't quite as deep as, as what I would like, but it is there. You can see the texture and it definitely is a really nice pattern. 20, about 26 bucks, 25 bucks on greenstuffworld.com with shipping a little bit more than that. So about 30 bucks for this one pen. So yeah, if you don't want to spend 30 and you don't mind having smaller tiles, you can go for one of these. This is by 4C, a texture rolling pen for, for basically caves, right? This was about Three, a little bit over three dollars on Amazon and of course I had to wait like three weeks or whatever to get it but it works about the depth of the the impression uh, is about the same the pattern this is a brick pattern you know it's okay I like going back over these with ballpoint pins this is going to how big the tile is I just recently did this tile I'm not sure if you guys can see this I just did this tonight it just took like a few minutes on a just an old scrap piece of, of foam and you guys can probably see the the uh, indentations there the texture um it actually does pretty good uh, obviously with some painting and some dry brushing that probably would come out a little bit better so uh i like them a little bit deeper than that you know but it's a good base pattern to start with and it's totally worth 30 bucks in my opinion that's it for green stuff world obviously greenstuffworld.com has lots of other really cool items on there too yeah or if you want to go cheap there you go. You can try these out. For what these are and how much you pay, these are actually pretty decent, I think. You're gonna have smaller tiles though. Number two, if your gamer is also into woodcraft, what normal people call woodworking, you might wanna check out the Jigsaw, Black & Decker 4.5 amp Jigsaw at Walmart. $29.99 for this. I went ahead and got a few extra blades, three extra blades, with a little bit over three bucks, about three bucks. 50 cents. It already comes with three blades, so you don't really have to get more blades. And there's a lot you can do with a jigsaw. It's crazy. Uh, I bought this for myself for Christmas. Wasn't that nice? Uh, I'll have some videos coming out real soon to show you guys what all you can do with this. You can do all sorts of stuff with a jigsaw. Uh, they're really awesome. Lots of other woodworking tools you can buy for 30 bucks or cheaper as well. Off the top of the head, Dremel, the rechargeable Dremel tool that's two speed, low and high. I believe that's coming in at like a little bit less than 20 bucks at Walmart. So you might want to check that out if you're into woodworking or if you're if you're a gamer that you're buying for this, this holiday season is into woodworking, it might be good to start with that. Number one, now, I already have a video about this. It's, it's been probably my favorite purchase. Wow, I, I can't hold them all. So this has been my favorite miniature board game purchase here lately. These things are selling like hotcakes all over. 
I bought these, uh, well, <laughs> I, I can't hold all the ones that I have now. I originally bought these three on Amazon for a little bit less than $25, which is a really good deal. But actually, um, all but the Zendikar box is selling right now at all sorts of stores all over the U.S. Um, for $5, $4.99 to be exact. One of the, th there are several stores selling them right now. I will put a link in the description below for the ones that I know about. You can't, as far as I know, you can only get Innistride and <laughs> these things are huge. They're pa jam packed with miniatures, dice, and all sorts of board game goodness. Uh, cards and, and wound markers and, and uh, custom dice for the game. This and this on sale right now at all sorts of stores and I'll put a link in, in uh, below. I'm in the Southeast. Ollie's is selling these for $4.99. Uh, Zendikar, you can still get on Amazon as far as I know uh, for about five bucks on Amazon. I don't know why the stores aren't selling Zendikar. I have no clue, but you can get this one on Amazon, about five bucks. Just go ahead and buy a case. Just just get it over with. Just buy a case. Just for Innistrad, Let, just, just real quick. 24 figures, this is five dollars. 24 figures, 48 spell cards, ter terrain, 2D terrain basically. Four dual-sided cardboard terrain boards, two glyphs, 20, 20 damage markers. Those are the wound markers I'm talking about. 20 sided, one 20 sided die. Uh, eight combat dice, 13 armor cards, 48 spell cards, turn marker, eight counters, five dollars. This is crazy. So yeah, this is the number one purchase of this holiday season as far as I'm concerned. Real quick, I have a bonus for you guys. If your gamer is also a bookworm and they have a collection, perhaps uh, a small library, if you will, or at least a, one bookshelf, if you wanna surprise them, just take a picture of what they have, go to the local thrift stores and used bookstores and talk to the folks there and they'll probably be happy to help you, especially the folks at the used bookstores. They should be able to help you locate what they have to offer uh, in the different series that your, your bookworm is into. For example, got this at Goodwill for $3. Yeah, another little gift to myself. This is a great book. If, if you ever want to include anything about dragons in your campaign, you, this is, a, I mean, for $3, are you kidding me? So uh, it's regular uh, $39.95 when it first came out. Okay, and I got it for $3 at Goodwill. So, all sorts of deals like that at used bookstores, you know, thrift stores and so forth and so on. This book looks like it's, it's barely been touched. That is a great gift for somebody who, like me, I like the older books. I know a lot of uh, people are really getting into the 5e right now. So maybe they want the new books. So you just kind of have to look at what they have and kind of judge by that. Books, never can go wrong with a bookworm getting them books, especially uh, when they're that cheap. Well, that's it for this year's Gamer's Gift Guide. I hope you guys really enjoyed that. If you would, please give us a like. If you haven't already, please subscribe. And as always, guys, thanks for watching.